dream that I'm gonna be at the top of the scene. I never wow. We're in towards the end of 2023. If you got a dream, okay. Hey everyone, it's Marcus. This is my review on 2023. I'll be explaining to you what type of content I did this year, some of the awesome things I did this year, giving you a rating on it, and and telling you what sort of content I've got planned for next year. Enjoy the video. So I thought 2023 was a really good year. I did a lot of content this year, like the day in life videos. But this year, I did a lot of content this year, such as I went to the Gold Coast with stellar experiences and I vlogged that Gold Coast trip. So basically, I went to Gold Coast, Queensland for a trip with stellar experiences. And I was hoping to meet up with my girlfriend, Amy Jones, as you may be aware of. I was hoping to meet up with her, but due to change of plans, she wasn't able to come, but I was still able to hang out with my friends at the Gold Coast trip. So the places I went to were Wet n Wild, Parasailing, I went to the Outback Spectacular dinner night where we had dinner and watched a show. So we watched an amazing show there, so. But also at the start of the year, I did holiday programs with flag stuff, so, which was really good. Apart from the Gold Coast trip and the holiday program with Flagstaff, I also worked two days a week at Flagstaff. I worked two days a week at my job and I also went back to the Slayers program which is where I learned all the life skills. I went back to the Slayers program this year to learn a bit more skills to gain more confidence. So the Slayers, the Slayers program this year was really good. This year was my third year at the Slayers this year was my third year at the Slayers program. It was really good. So, but next year, but next year I will be returning to the Slayers program to learn a bit more skills. So, yeah. Apart from, apart from the Slayers program, I obviously did stellar outings with stellar experiences. The outings I did with stellar were holy moly. I also went on holy trips as well. I went to holy moly. I went to. A few other outings as well, like Hang Dog, and a few other ones as well with Stella. But it was really good to do outings with Stella. So yeah, apart from doing, apart from doing Stella and Flag stuff as well, I also, I also returned to my iTech course Screen Media. So on Thursday, I went to iTech course Screen Media, and did a bit more studying this year. But I also made my but I also made a film called Fight for the Will, which was directed by a good friend, Trey Stokes, who is fully stoked productions I five on YouTube. I made that film with him, which was his film. We made his film at iTech, which was absolutely amazing. So that film that film was where I played the role of lawyer, which was really fun to do. I enjoyed playing the lawyer. It was really good to play the lawyer and stuff. Apart from having iTech this year, I also had my one-on-one -on -one with my support worker, Reese, who was my old support worker. Then I had Toby. So I've been doing a lot of stuff with Toby as well, like travel training and goal setting. So we focus more on goals. We focus more on goal setting and travel training stuff. But we also did cooking, which was really good to see what I did. So yeah. My favourite part of this year was probably the one-on-ones with Toby with my support worker. I really liked focusing on my goals and doing money handling skills. We focused on needs and wants on our one-on-ones because, because we thought focusing on needs and wants was really beneficial was really beneficial and helped me with my money handling skills. So, so I think this year I am slowly improving on it. So, like I mentioned, I thought 2023 was a really good year. I did stuff with Stella, like Oztake as well. I also did Oztake with Stella experience as well. We lost a few games at Oztake as well, but we played really well as a team with all the people in our group. So we played really well for our Oztake group as well. But yeah, so, but one of the things I'm really impressed about this year was how much content I've done. I um, was really impressed with how much content 
I did this year, so yeah. As I mentioned, I did a lot of content this year, like for example, I did the day in life videos on ones like living with a disability, so, but we've done a lot of day in life videos, so. But unfortunately, we weren't able to do the bullying film called The Victim due to the weather and people pulling out. But stay tuned for next year. Next year, we have our bullying film, The Victim. So, my plans for next year. My plans for next year are I'm going to be doing a lot more content like I did this year. So, for example, we have season two of my day in life series, which is a day in life on words like living with disability. We have season two of it this year, next year. So, so, so season two of the Day in Life series will be mainly talk about, will be, will be mainly talking about my motor tick and how my motor tick affects me in public. So it'll be more sort of talking about what it's like me. It'll be, ma it'll mainly talk about what it's like for me. It'll mainly talk about what it's like for me to have a tick in public. So for example, it'll show my, for example, it'll show my experience of what it's like for me to have a tick in public for example like when I t for example it'll talk about it'll talk about how my motor tick affects me in public so that'll be a good season of it so the other type of content I will do will be my short films like I mentioned will be the bullying film the victim and the other film which is two things detectives episode two the death of detective page and uh, we'll also be doing a live action Spider-Man. More information about the Spider-Man film coming out to you really soon. So we'll be doing a few short films next year, which will be really cool to sort of do. So I'm really looking forward to content next year. So, and I'm also hoping to do live streams on my channel. I, I do apologize for not doing any live streams this year. I've been really busy with a lot of stuff around YouTube and stuff. I've been busy. I've also been busy creating content for you all as well. But stay tuned for season two of my day in life series and stay tuned for some more stuff of my, and stay tuned for some more episodes of my documentary. I have released two episodes of my documentary, but, we'll, but, but we will be releasing the third episode of my documentary next year. So stay tuned for that and keep an eye out for that episode so shout out to stellar experiences shout out to stellar experiences for allowing me to do some of my daily life videos with them and doing some of the vlogs with the group and with, with the group with the group in our outings and a lot of other stuff as well and thanks to, and thank you to my support worker toby as well who's taking me on my on my one on ones and thank you to my other old support and thank you to my old support worker Reese who took me the first time on my one on one so yeah. But I'm also looking forward to going back to my iTech tech course this year. Um, but I'm also looking forward to going to my iTech course next year where I've got two sub where I'm gonna be doing to uh, where where I'm gonna be doing other other subjects as well. So yeah. Anyways, I'm basically going to end the video here. Thank you for watching this review on 2023. If you're new to my channel, subscribe. If you'd like to keep up there, follow me on Instagram with awesome stories. Let me know in the comment section down below what you thought of this video because I like, I like to know, I like, because I like to know your thoughts and what you thought of it. And also, let me know in the comment section down below what you thought of the year because I like to know your thoughts and what you thought of the year. Stay tuned for some more updates and some awesome content. Oh, stay tuned for some more updates and some awesome content off my channel. And for the last time, I'll see you all later. Bye for now.